Brendan Rigby as he's done for most of the night. Leads them up into Pagel's corner for the first time outside of him. Patrick Ray in the 31 car and then Charlotte Christensen in 22. Braden Steppens would be the next one. Cooper Reed tucked in there in the 17 back to uh, Hannah Christensen. Jared Pools in 47. Taron Francis in front of Khan Thurgood and tailed out at the moment is Jackson Brims and that's the way they've completed one lap of the Junior Sedans New Stars. A little bit of touching in the corner but our race leader is Patrick Ray in position number two Aidan Rigby. Back behind them it's Charlotte Christensen and then we've got uh, Braden Steppens as our race leader starting to put a bit of distance between himself and the rest of the field that's Patrick Ray he goes round the hairpin and heads up the zinc straight away in front of Aidan Rigby back then to Charlotte Christensen then we've got Braden Steffens and Cooper Reed trying to join in this little battle down the back chute and into the hairpin corner as uh, Patrick Ray gets it a little bit wobbly that time's allowing Aidan Rigby to catch up to him settling down to argue the point with 11 to go they'll go round the outside of Jackson uh, Brems as they go round Pagel's corner don't want to get too wide on the racetrack just enough room to escape through as Aidan Rigby's down on the inside of uh, Patrick Ray side by side they go Patrick Ray on the outside Aidan Rigby on the inside they're going to go together to Pagel's corner Aidan Rigby will get the better of the drive down lower on the racetrack and goes back into the race lead with Patrick Ray in position number two back then we go to Charlotte Christensen who's got her own battle there with Braden Steppens Next one through would be Cooper Reed, And then we go to the 27 of Hannah Christensen. Round Pagel's corner. Aidan Rigby's got a fight on his hands this time. Taron Francis is the next car in front of them. Aidan Rigby goes through the hairpin corner in front of Patrick Ray. Bit of a gap back to Charlotte Christensen. Eight laps remaining in the journey. And then a bit of a gap back to Braden Steffens as they go to the inside of Taron Francis around Pagel's corner and he's starting to put a bit of a distance between himself and Patrick Ray. That's our race leader, Aidan Rigby. Up the zinc straight away, straight away he goes. Patrick Ray, next one through would be Charlotte Christensen and then Braden Steffens. No change in the order as they go careering down the back straight away. Race leader, Aidan Rigby. Through the hairpin and up the zinc straight he goes. He's dropped off Patrick Ray just that little bit as uh, Braden Steffens gets the hairpin corner all wrong. We go back to our race leader who's down on the inside of Kantharagood. Puts a car between himself and Patrick Gray, although Patrick Gray also sneaks by with five laps remaining. Back in position, and number three is still Charlotte Christensen. Cooper Reed would be the next one, and then Braden Steffens. So, getting right in amongst some of the slower traffic right now, as they put another lap on Jackson Brems, is our race leader. Aidan Rigby, Rigby round Pagel's corner, he's got the uh, Jared Poole car, the next one in front of him and in front of that is Hannah Christensen into the hairpin corner, Hannah Christensen, Jared Poole on the outside will be Aidan Rigby, Rigby goes around that outside, putting another car between himself and Patrick Ray, round Pagel's corner, Aidan Rigby down the inside, he goes of Hannah Christensen. Patrick Ray tries to follow into the hairpin, but it doesn't work. Our race leader is heading up the zinc straight. Can't be too many laps remaining in the event. In fact, the next time round, he will get a white flag. So Aidan Rigby, around Pagel's corner he goes and heads down the back chute. 
as uh, Patrick Ray gets it a little bit close to the concrete, but he's got a car in front of him and he can't see the race leader now. The race leader has got a full length of the main straightaway. The white flag is out as down the back shoot goes Aidan Rigby. And we've got Khan Tharagood parking in the wrong place in the hairpin and that will probably bring on a yellow, uh, sorry, a chequered flag as well. And Aidan Rigby, he's had a big night here in the Junior New Stars. We'll get the lap of honour with the Corbett's group chequered flag. So as he goes around, folks, put your hands together for him. He's been too good tonight in the New Stars. Aidan Rigby takes out the feature race. Good run into second place by uh, Patrick Ray. I think you find Cooper Reed home in position number three. Well done to our juniors. Good racing here tonight. The racetrack's come back to us after a little bit of fun and games after the rain. Production still to come.